Give him a nice hand. Adam. <laughs> Adam. Ray, give him a nice hand. I like doing stand-up as a job. Beats what I was doing before this. For six years, I worked at Universal Studios Hollywood, the theme park. Yeah, sure. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. You worked there, too? Oh, you work at Disneyland. All right. Well, you share my pain. <laughs> Made your parents proud. Um, I played Wolverine for six years, right? So I was one of the X-Men. Uh, yeah, I was living the dream and uh, you know the best part honestly about the job there are some really cool things that come along because like, the kids they look at you and they actually think you're the characters like that is such a weird situation to be a part of right there was a kid four years old on my second day on the verge of tears he walks up to me he's like you're just about my favorite thing in the whole world yeah right and I was like oh my god you are such a nerd <laughs> this kid <laughs> this kid is never gonna get laid you know, it was adorable, don't get me wrong, but to me, as soon as he said that, I'm like, dude, I'm, a, I'm just a Jewish guy in a blue spandex suit, right? With a wig and fake metal claws, right? I'm just, I'm trying to make a few extra bucks, right? Just straight out of college, and this kid's calling me his hero. It th threw me off. I never heard that word thrown on me before, right? Put a lot of pressure on me. I had to talk him down. I was like, hero? Hero? Dude, take it easy with that word, buddy. Dude, kid, let me tell you something. Last week, I got high and stole bread from Ralph's, all right? I'm not somebody we'll be looking up to. I do weird shit, man. Why don't you go talk to Spider-Man? He just graduated law school, all right? Hey, tell me about Universal Studios. Well, I started out as a tour guide, and then I, uh, on the tram. Son of a bitch. You yeah. know, I tried to get a job as a tour guide there when I first moved out here. All they can give me was crowd control in the parking lot. <laughs> For real? Yeah. With, the, you know, the lights, the sticks. I said, you could take that job and shove it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it wasn't all cracked up. Do you I mean, remember the tour at all? Uh, yeah. I mean, I'd make up a lot of shit because... Uh, because people, they didn't, nobody really knew the facts. They yeah. give you this whole notebook of facts about every spot, but I would, people were taking pictures, so I, we'd drive by bushes. I was Tell like, me the Jaws thing, though. You're going by the Jaws thing. Coming up on it. Oh, God. Um, Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> uh, sweet point of back. Um, Here's what I would say. You'd be remembering it. I'll tell you what I'd say. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, coming up right now on your right, you'll see the famous town of... Uh, uh, Amityville? Amityville, yeah. And... Um, <laughs> um, um, there was some word that there was a uh, spotting of a shark there, uh, but uh, I think that's nonsense. Yeah, we got a great summer ahead of us. We got a lot of good swimming, <laughs> and um, so keep your hands inside just in case. Uh, and then we go across the bridge, and what happens? And then you stop, and then uh, you go, "Hey, there's uh, there's Steve. Our friend Steve is out there. Uh, hey, wave to Steve, everybody. Well, wave to Steve, everybody. He's in the scoop. We got his." Cheesy, and uh, and so Steve's in the water. And you're like, oh, look at Steve, and he's uh, just checking the waters for us. And then, uh, and then, and then all of a sudden, there's a then shark there's a scuba coming. diver that comes out of the yeah. And then the he pops boat. up and like, and he, everybody uh, wave to Steve. And then he goes down, and then the music starts, and you see the shark fin. You're like, oh, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait a minute, Steve. Oh, okay, Steve. No, Steve, you need to get out of there. Steve, Steve, everybody, yell at me, but please help me. Steve, we gotta get out of the water. Steve, Steve, and I would flip <laughs> out, and I would just like really try to commit to it because I was like, I'm a f actor, and uh, <laughs> and uh, and I went to. Four years at USC, and <laughs> now I'm working at a theme park. And uh, so I would commit to it, and then the shark and Jaws would take him down, and I would just go ape, and I would scream and yell. And some the, to the point, one of my bosses wrote my evaluation to her, and they had to tone me down because there was a couple that like the kid was crying because I was flipping out so much. I was like, "Sweet God, Steve, get out of the water! God damn it, don't you listen!" And this kid's like, "What the f is going on right now? Why is he screaming at an animatronic?" And the kid knew what an animatronic was. I know, like, uh, how old were you then? Like, 23 or something? Yeah, 20, 23. Probably scoping out all the girls on the tram. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, uh... Trying to impress them. I mean, I was, trying, I was pretty focused on my job, Kevin. Uh, <laughs> I, I was pretty you. focused on the, on the bullshit facts. I didn't Did you ever get an acting job offer from that? Um, there was a guy who I could tell was not in the business. Cause <laughs> he came up to me and he was like, because we did this one tra uh, tour and I would make up things. Cause people, like I said, people would take pictures. So we drove by these bushes and I was like, if you remember, folks, those bushes were in the movie uh, Bushes 1 and the sequel Bushes 2, <laughs> Attack of the Bushes. You might remember that scene when Al Pacino was like, oh, that's a lot of bushes. And people just started taking pictures. People just started taking pictures of bushes. And so the guy comes up, he's like, you know, it's really funny when you did that little bushes bit. You did that bushes bit. That was real funny. You know, I'm a casting officer. And I was like, that officer. doesn't sound right at all. Yeah. And he goes, I'm a casting officer. I run an office. And, uh, and we'd love to have you in for some projects. <laughs> he runs an oh. office. Yeah. So as he said that, I was just like, nah, I don't know. And I was like, well, can I have a card? And he's like, fresh out of cards. Been giving them out all day. And I was like, all right. So <laughs> I'll send my assistant over with a cashier's check. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right. So I know you have to go. Yeah. Because you got... Uh, you got another tour coming up? You sure. got the tram is leaving in another five minutes? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So a nice hand for Adam Ray, Thank ladies you so and gentlemen. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks, Adam. Adam Ray.